It is freezing cold. We're in winter in Melbourne, but I've come to the place where I'm about to buy some new fish. Now this is a dream fish, which is gonna go in this community aquarium with another fish that I just recently got. And we have gotten together and we've called this fish Rosa. And she is about to get a partner. Let's go inside where it's a lot warmer. Okay, we've come into my local store, which is in Fern Tree Gully in Melbourne. And I will just say one thing about a recent thing that Pets Domain have done. They have got a membership where if you pay a certain amount of money to be a member, there are all these discounts available. So well worth looking into that. And this is one big pile of wood. Have a look at that. Now, I was here yesterday looking at a fish and I found a dream fish. And I was so excited, but uh, I didn't have the money on me to pick it up because it was a bit more than I was expecting to pay. But I'm back today and I thought we'd look at some fish while we're here because there's a few fish in stock, which uh, I thought I'd show you all. So we've got some garamis up here. They're always a terrific fish for a centerpiece for a community aquarium. And the lace pearl garamis are a particularly peaceful larger fish. Uh, the golden garamis, of course, are very colorful, but can be a little bit more bossy. So those are here. We've got some sharks, and everyone knows I love my red tail shark. We have got a lot of barbs in here, and barbs give you tremendous activity as well as color. And uh, for a lot of people, even in a planted tank, barbs will do very, very well. We've got some smaller garamis over here, and also some little golden rams, which are a beautiful fish. We've got some Crebensis cichlids. If I can get the camera to focus, there we go. We've got a very nice looking blue ram there. And some tetras, some black tetras, black neons. We've got some albino black skirt tetras here. A couple of uh, very nice little male guppies to look at. And a few more male guppies in there. Some very, very attractive angelfish. Some Congo tetras. We've got, let's see, some discus fish in here. Some little coral blue neon garamis. We've got some smaller angelfish. Some glow light tetras. We've got some silver sharks, which of course get enormous and only for people with very, very big tanks. Some Bolivian rams. Some silver dollars. Some African cichlids that obviously I can't have in my tank. We've got some more African cichlids over here, some Mbuna. We've got a few community fish in this tank. And the, uh, the black phantom tetras are a really nice fish that many people can have in their tank. Some little clown loaches, and I love my clown loaches. Lots of tetras in here, some cherry barbs, uh, as well as a few supper fish on the bottom. And for those people with a large tank, these Pictus catfish. Beautiful, beautiful looking fish. Incredibly long whiskers, very active. And they do get large and they like to eat small fish. So not for everybody. 
And these large, impressive crustaceans are Australian yabbies. Uh, not always ideal with fish, they do eat plants, but something different in an aquarium. There's a very large cold water section in the Pets Domain stores, and there's a lot of very, very nice goldfish. Goldfish come in so many different forms, shapes, colours. They are a really, really happy, friendly little fish to have uh, at home, either indoors in a fish tank or often outdoors in a pond. So lots and lots of fish in store today. Oh, Siamese fighting fish, always, always a delight to look at. And this little guy here looks really, really nice. There is an incredible range of colours available in better fish today. So if you look at your local stores, you'll see an incredible number of just amazingly colourful fish. Now if you want to know which male better I got from my aquarium, make sure you tune in for the next video, which is coming up very soon. But meanwhile, why not watch one of these videos?